Metal solutions, when heated in a Bunsen flame, show characteristic colours. To test this in the laboratory, you use a flame test, which is an analytical procedure for detecting the presence of certain elements, usually metal ions. Metal salts are often used in fireworks because of the colours they produce. In order to carry out the flame test, you need to have a clean flame test wire. To do this, dip the wire into concentrated acid and heat in the hottest part of the flame until no change in the flame colour is observed. You may need to do this a couple of times. Now, let's look at some of the colours that certain metals produce. Sodium produces an orange colour. Sodium is often used in streetlights and is present in salt. Potassium produces a lilac colour when placed into the flame. Lithium produces a bright red colour. Calcium produces a brick red colour. Barium produces a pale green colour. Copper compounds can produce either a green or blue-green colour in the flame depending on the anion present. For example, Copper halides produce blue-green colours, whereas copper non-halides produce a green colour. Lead produces a pale blue colour. Sodium, potassium, calcium, barium and copper salts are often used in fireworks to produce the different colours in the display.